Hi, I'm Tony Fleming, and this is Fleming's Ultimate Garage. Hey, right, thanks for joining us on today's video. I don't think there's a whole lot I need to say about this car other than what you've read so far, but look at the, look at the colors and how everything really works so beautifully on here. This marina blue paint uh, with the red line tires on there. These are custom made 17 inch red line tires. We'll look at those in just a second. This has a couple small upgrades on it that make the driving just a little bit nicer. You know, as we get older, uh, there's some uh, accoutrements that we, that we would probably like when we go. And this car has those. So you get this old school look, but it drives so nice, especially with the big footprint of the wheels and tires. This car has air conditioning, has an upgraded digital sound system. It is really, really just a, a spectacular car to look at. And then it's also great when you throw another couple in the back and go to dinner. You can take the kids someplace. You can take the husband or wife, or whatever it is, go for a ride. Just take it to work, do whatever it is. It is a lot, a lot of fun. So come on up, let's look at some paint first, okay? This is nicely done because, uh, you know, you want to be able to read uh, nice and clearly the letters in there. We do this on every car and we can show that some paint looks better than others. This is really nice, deep looking paint, just looks great. And uh, I just like uh, so many things on here from the new stainless to the, uh, the grill, the call outs, the trim, uh, everything on here has either been replated, redone or replaced. All right. All right, so let's take a peek under the hood for a minute and then we can see uh, some detail under there because there's a lot of money spent there. I'm showing Dustin where the hood release is and this is how this works. He hates when he can't find the hood release. It's like this pride. Anyway, come on up here and check this out. So this started life as the Mark IV Big Block family. It's an SS396 uh, style uh, convertible. This one here is an uh, board and stroke to 454 cubic inches. And now here we have air conditioning, we have power steering, we have power disc brakes. And these are the kinds of things that you need to be looking for when you're getting a car because you forget to ask about that stuff. Listen, man, today's modern cars are the best cars ever built. They're really very nice. You can throw the key in it when it's four degrees outside and it's ready to go by the time you buckle your seatbelt. These cars here, uh, unless they're restored to this level, can uh, we can forget about stuff. Like, they didn't come standard with power steering. They didn't come standard with disc brakes or power disc brakes or air conditioning. This car here has all of that. And it's so nicely done, the satin black inside here like it's supposed to. It's actually a little bit over restored where it's painted inside here, buffed and waxed, and, but you know what? I like it for that. So then there's another level of detail that we forget too that makes this very nice driving quality. For instance, what we have is a factory fan here. And then we also have an electric pusher fan here. So no matter what, even if you're stuck in traffic and there's not air flowing through the radiator, this is pushing air over it, keeping the car nice and cool. That way you can have the AC on and not have uh, uh, the risk of overheating, okay? I want to take us a peek real quick. Check out the upgraded suspension from the hammer tone. Look at the size of the sway bar, but the frame's all painted, the suspension's all new. You can kind of see all the fresh stuff that's in there, just so you know exactly what kind of car you're getting and how nice it really looks. Let's take a peek in the trunk. This is kind of cool, because this lets it, the only reason this is here is to let the, that guy that you just spanked know what spanked it, huh? Okay, let's take a peek in here for a second, and this is some of the detail you need to be looking at. So it's all painted and buffed in here. Uh, everything is kind of new in here. Look at how nice the trunk is done. Uh, all nice, you can see the ribs. It's not all gooped up with body filler and stuff. I pulled these out just so you can see the new wiring that's been done in the car, okay? That gets tucked right back up in here. We'll rewrap that. Just really, really a nicely done turn. New gaskets, weather stripping, decals, all that kind of good stuff. Just, uh, I don't know, just a great, first off, I just love the color of the car. It makes it, it makes the whole car even better, so anyway. All right, so let's check out the inside. All right. All right, all right, all right. Okay, a couple things that I wanted to talk about. First off, I love the console. Uh, this car didn't have a console when we got it. I just put the console in. Um, so this we installed as a clock, and it's working. So I normally like to say, wow, what a great restoration, but we installed the clock. I like it. Uh, what I might suggest, and we're happy to do this for you, is to take this right here and actually move it inside the glove box. It kind of keeps the dash all stock looking unless you like it right there. So that's easy still to get to. They kept the stock radio in place here. Uh, the heating and air conditioning controls are right there. So this car kind of looks like it's stock inside, but it has an upgraded sound system and we're moving these speakers uh, to the side panels right there. Uh, so that's where they'll be by the time you purchase this car. 
All right, that'll give you lots of room to have another couple back there. Sometimes we haven't finished up the restoration. I just like to call out the stuff that we're gonna finish up that uh, you would get before uh, that arrives at your place. But I like to do the videos. There's so many of these cars in progress and process right now, it's hard to keep up. All the dash is restored, full gauge is there, knee knocker tack. Knee knocker can be on this side, knee knocker tack can be on this side. Uh, that's a great name for a tachometer, but uh, uh, it's, I don't know, it's just a really cool car. I, I get a little excited about this because it's just nicely done. You see covers, foam, carpets, kick panels, convertible top, convertible top boot, stuff like that. Enough of my rambling, how about I fire it up for you so you can hear what it sounds like. Look how easy that is to fire up. Nice. Mm. As we close up this video, I just want to remind you guys real quick one more time. This is a long distance driver car, meaning that you could throw another couple in the car, throw the kids in the car, and go for an hour or two drive with the air conditioning, the power steering, the power disc brake, the much bigger upgraded wheel and tire package on the car. It just handles and drives so nice. It's just a gorgeous, gorgeous car. Top up or top down, it looks great. Anyway, if you can find a way to get a really cool uh, Super Sport 396 four speed air conditioned, disc brake, whatever, whatever, whatever in your life, you got to find a way. Call us 301-816-1000 before you miss out.